Hello everybody, welcome to iBlockchain channel. Actually, many people asked me to create a token contract that gives the tax in stablecoin like USDT and USDT. And finally, I'm already created two versions of the smart contract that give you the tax in USDT and in USDC. So, in this video, you will learn how to deploy your token and get the tax in a stable coin. Okay, let's start. The first step we need to download the contract code. Actually, this contract is completely free. So, let's start by downloading this free contract. Go to zeroxfactory.com and here from the left side menu, click tokens contract. This is the page of the tokens contract. Okay, we will find here in the first row. The first one is the contracts that give you the tax in BNB. This is a normal one. The new one here, the second one is the new one. This give you the tax in USDT. The third one give you the tax in USDC. Actually, the three contracts exactly the same code, but a little different between them to just give you the tax in a different coin. So let's go with this one that give you the tax in USDT and click download now to redirect to the github this code is completely free on github so you can download it okay let's copy this code by selecting the code and click copy or just click the copy button here just click this copy now we copied already the code okay let's start the blowing now go to remix and start and here in the contract folder create new file for example my token my token dot sol okay and paste your code here okay this is our code okay let's now start edit some details before deploying here on the line yes here on the line 548 we need to edit some little uh, details here this is token token here the contract name it is better to make the contract name same your token name for example my token name will be my token my token okay this is my token name and scroll down a little bit to reach the line number 563 this one t total this number this number is the total supply of your token the default number is 100 million you can change it by increasing or decreasing for example i want to make my token to be 300 million so i will edit it to be 300 million this number is your token total supply and here the token name itself okay my token will be for example my space token this is my token name my token okay this is the symbol of my token i will make it t key n okay and leave the decimals 18 like normal and the last step is uh, determining the liquidity fee or the tax this is the tax liquidity fee here the default uh, the default value is four person four here mean four person so you can increase or decrease it whatever you want but you have to know something really important this percent will divide it into two halves the first half will go to your uh, liquidity pool and the other half will go to your marketing wallet so, for example, if this 4% means 2% will go to your marketing wallet and 2% will go to, to increase the liquidity pool, will add it to your token liquidity pool to increase it. So, you can change this value by increase it or decrease it, but I recommend it to not make your tax really high. So, if you wanted to increase this, just increase it a little bit, not really high, okay? only that this is only what we need before deploying the contract nothing else just uh, edit this data the contract name make it your uh, token name of course without the spaces and here is your total supply and here the token name token symbol and here the liquidity fee this is the tax okay nothing else okay let's start uh, compiling and deploying the contract the first thing we need to compile click here this icon solidity compiler and i prefer always to make it enable optimization this is better 
to make it like that and click combine my token dot sol this will compile your contract okay we already compiled it and you will find here the the check icon okay great after compiling already completed it will take just a few seconds now the last step is deploying the contract here on this icon deploy and run transaction click this icon the icon of ethereum okay and here change the environment to be injected provider metamask of course you have to already installed the metamask on your browser and have some bnb balances for the transaction okay okay and here from the contract we have to choose our token contract this contract my token contracts slash my token that also it's choose this contract my contract okay and here we need to put two parameters the owner wallet and the marketing wallet okay let's copy my wallet i will make this wallet to be my owner wallet here the owner wallets mean the wallet which own the token the token after created will send it to this wallet the second one is the marketing wallet the marketing wallet is the wallet which receive the tax so you can make it a different wallet or the same owner wallet no problem it will work okay so in this example i will make it the same wallet and click transact and click confirm to confirm the transaction of course i will not continue confirming that because i don't want to pay a money for uh, just a test uh, token okay so in your case you will click confirm after that the remix will create your own token that give you the tax in usdt I hope this video is useful for you and click like if you like it and subscribe to get all our new videos. Thanks for watching and good luck for all.